Sometimes when you're out fishing, you have a part that gets too stuck to undo the normal way, tapping it through. Um, to demonstrate this, I pulled this tight, extra tight. If that happens, you can unscrew the butt cap here. Take that off. And then just slide out only those parts that are jammed. In this case, the two tip sections. And I'm going to take those and put my fingers on both sides next to the joint that's stuck and push together while twisting opposite directions. And a lot of times that will get it unstuck. But if that doesn't work, I'm going to show you a rubber band trick which is going to pound it against a hard table or a book. Uh, since I don't want to dent my table, I've got this cardstock that I'm going to dent it against. And you take a rubber band, and we're just going to tie an overhand knot. Actually, you might wrap it around one time so you got a lot of rubber band on there. And then tie the overhand knot. I'll just help it grip the rod section so it doesn't slide up and down. It's a little hard to tie this knot, but it works really good once you get it done here. Alright, so we've got it tied, so we got a loop on both sides here. I'm going to stick one finger in here, and a thumb in here. And you want to keep that wide. If you're too narrow, it's not going to shoot as hard. The wider you have it, the harder it's going to shoot down against this paper, or this hard surface. You're just going to lift it and let go. I find it best to hold your hand around the rod so it doesn't try to go sideways. So if you lift it up and keep it inside your hand up here, I'll keep it from whacking down on the side there. Do that a couple times, keeping your fingers wide. And see this one came down. That usually works, and that, what that is is the vibration when it hits here brings that through where normal pushing it in wouldn't work. Just demonstrate that again. Wrap the rubber band around your, around the back side, then round again before you tie the overhead knot. Put your finger and thumb in the loops, keep it wide, and then just lift and let it smack down on that hard surface. Usually I check it, even though it hasn't gone in, I check it every once in a while. Sometimes it's right there ready to slide in after you've done that a few times and all it needs is just a little push. But that's the rubber band trick to get a, a stuck section unstuck.